you can't always judge the numbers on how you're performing, and he's been okay, but he's another one of those players that when you look at the upside for Melbourne United... Oh, wait a gift. And what about Harrison? <laughs> Just with the two-hand stuff. As we see the dunk from Harrison, and Sobey put it right on the spot from long run. It's Brisbane with the momentum in quarter number one as Johnson loses the handle. And Melbourne can get busy with numbers up the floor. It's Illy. Takes it all himself. That's a great push from Shea Illy, putting heat on the rim. The defense didn't commit. So he's still struggling a bit, but re taped, and he's gonna, looks like he's going to give it a go. Well, you did say that, Liam, that you thought we'd see him back at some stage. Sobey fires away. Well, that man right there, Nathan Sobey. Just on the stroke of quarter time. They bring it back to three, the difference. Krebs will have to take it himself. Does! Scores! Brisbane finish the corner in style. In a timeout, I want you to do a list of the five top green light players in the competition. <laughs> Two more for Johnson. Hobson uses the Landale screen and steps back, gets Landale involved. Nice offense, Melbourne. That's a nice pass. By that offensive punch, he's looking aggressive tonight so far. As Brisbane turn it over, Golding lays it up, but Vic Law sends him packing. Make us a play, big fella. He had one earlier tonight, didn't pay off, but there, nice little fadeaway. Little 5 0 run for the home team comes to a very sudden end via Jock Landale. And he didn't go, he didn't accept the screen, he just popped, and defense didn't stay with him. Hodgson's got some work to do because he had Jack White lurking in the background with the block. Over 50%, and each one of those times the team that did that won the game. It was cut by Golding, and up he goes. Hang on, he's turning back the clock ever so slightly, is Chris Golding. When he was a young fella, we used to see that from him. Chris Golding, as we mentioned, there's the overplay. Feeds Hobson, who's feeling pretty good about himself. He doesn't make it count. Landale on the offensive glass. Sees that he's matched up by Kadee. That's too good to pass up. Timeout coming now for the Bullets. Jason Kadee looked him off. Well, he hasn't had enough touches. Ooh, Trimmick goes up for the stuff. No mercy from Dean Vickerman. Law. It's Hodgson underneath. Points are good. Jeez, he's looked good down there tonight. And just enjoying the game. He'll get you. Golding for three. Back to Nathan Sobey. Landale did enough to protect the rim. Hobson with the extra number takes it all himself. Scotty Hobson finishing off for Melbourne United. You know. What we're used to seeing from the superstar import and what he did so much for the breakers. And in crunch time, he's just not getting the ball. Melbourne's throw it away. A steal from Sobey. And then he can get himself inside. Oh. And wraps it around for the layup. Hope he's up and about. Look at the athletic finish here. He was the man who created the play with the steal. Gets it back from Kadee. And look at that. Sobe nearly lost possession. Took on all the tall timber. Gave it off to Johnson and he lost the ball. Golding. That is going to hurt. Ball game. Wow. Landau. 20 points, has had a good night, and that is good night. Jack White with the emphasis. They've passed it with flying colours. My word, they have from the three-point line. Oh, please, please, Chris. Golding <laughs> finishes it off for Melbourne, and they pass a big test tonight. They were pushed all the way by the Brisbane Bullets. Winners, 109 to 96 at Nissan Arena.